South Korea is continuing to push its latest cutting-edge weapons at one of the largest international defense trade shows currently being held in Europe. Calling cooperation with South Korea very satisfying, the head of one Polish defense company highlighted similar threats facing Poland and South Korea. Our defense correspondent Chim Min Jung reports. On day two of the 31st International Defense Industry Exhibition in Poland, South Korean defense companies promoted a variety of weapons to win additional orders. Hyundai Rotom announced that it is discussing a second contract for K2 tanks with Poland following last year's order of 1,000 tanks. It is a little later than initially planned, but because it is such a large and long-term project, there are quite a few things that need to be discussed. Hyundai Rotom's representative for Europe added that there are many neighboring European countries, including Romania and Lithuania, that are showing interest in replacing their tanks. Meanwhile, Hana Aerospace signed an MOU with state-owned defense firm Polish Armaments Group for the localization of its Chummu multiple launch rocket system. Last year, Poland bought some 280 Chummu rocket launchers, and the MOU is expected to lead to a second deal in the near future. On top of this, Hana Group promoted its Tangbogo 3 class submarine, as the Polish Navy is actively looking to procure submarines as part of its recently relaunched Orca submarine program. SNT Dynamics, a South Korean defense manufacturer, also promoted its products. Many Polish soldiers had a look. People showed great interest in the 1,500 to 1,700 horsepower transmission for the K2 tank and the 1,000 horsepower K9 transmission. The CEO of Polish Armaments Group showed his appreciation for South Korea's cooperation and noted that the two countries are very similar in the sense that they both understand the dangers stemming from threats from a neighboring country. We have entered a very far-reaching strategic cooperation already. If there is a threat to Poland or South Korea, then one country can help the other. The CEO added that although it may not be visible now, he's confident that cooperation between the two countries will come into effect if one country is attacked. Chemin Dang, Arirang News.